Hello, welcome to Worldopia channel. Today we are going to review the new spinners that we got it from Walmart and Target and they are all like licensed product with Star Wars. Um, this is a cube. Uh, we are going to review it later in our next videos. And we are going to, uh, this is from Amazon. This is the, the marbles throat hammers. And this is Star Wars, um, our 2D2 spinners. And on the top is our, the top five, the best seller um, spinner right now. Um, so this is the Sankan, and we all know that. And this, right now they, they are selling for $10 a piece. And same as Taizes, they used to be $30. So these are like $10, you can buy. And this one is uh, Triniums, and this is like kind of like the UFO spinners, but this is really cool, they give extra bearing. And uh, the other one is the Angry Wolf, they're still like $30 a piece. Uh, so they're still expensive. They have a black one coming. Uh, and this is a gut spin. Uh, we like this one a lot. It's small compact and the color is really nice so let's see how they compare so we'll take it out first so this is just two different two different type of hammer with different colors so the this is pretty nice so this one say who's ever hold the hammers if he's be worthy shall possess the power throat so this is really cute it's all metal no plastic part the very high end this one like um six seven dollars and this is just different colors so we'll try to spin it like vertically so this one lead, you can break, you can customize it so it gives it extra like, um, stop so you can make your own hammers in that kind of like hand spinner. So this one is, oh, we'll just spin it both way. And this is, like, we got it on eBay. This one looks pretty cool. You know that all these is less than $10. So it's very good buy, except these two, they are more like premium, but this is that old metal. Even though like it's not a kind of like CNC metal, look at like kind of this one is, uh, so this one is a CNC. This one looks pretty good. So the price does come down a lot and also without a lot of the, the bad players in the Amazon, Amazon Marketplace. So you'll get that pretty good, but the pretty good quality for a decent price. Um, but the eBay, this is coming from eBay. So we'll put a link up there. So it really depends on the quality, kind of like their hit or miss. Uh, this one looks pretty decent. So. This is, I got it from Target, and they are in the Star Wars session. So this one looks pretty cool. It's R2-D2, they are all licensed products. They are like around that, sometimes it's around $10, or less than $10, but they still have plastic. But it's, it's cool. I'm sure you can, yeah, you can really open it. And this is from Walmart. So this is Zuru spinners. Look at this is original. The one designed the, the feature cube. So, so this is a licensed product too. So let's see how to open it. So 
So this one is more like traditional spinners with the, let me see, with the Wonder Woman logo on the top, on the cap. So you can see that, see the, the barrier is a little bit uneven. So it's a way they pop up. This is very, very soft. Or maybe it's just the weathering. So I'm not sure that what type of bearing it is. And we'll see. So let's get started. So we'll do the same thing. We'll spin the sun pump first. You probably have like 10 seconds, 15 seconds differences. So let's. And remember that we also have the videos. We are giving away the finger rings and also the the pygmy pop. They are kind of popular right now. So this one is a little bit uneven, so you can really spin it on the tabletop, but you can spin it with your hand. So we can take a look. Now, this is very high end, high quality. This is a brass construction with R1 ATA bearing inside. And you can customize it to two ways. One is kind of a like hammer style, in, or as an individual like like bar spinners. Come with two different colors. Oops. So so these two already stop. So these are R two D two. It's like that plastic. Like the Lucas film. So I wish they make a LED light here to make a, our some sort of sound that really will make these uh, great spinners. But this is kind of plastic, cute R2D2 style. Pretty good design. And this one, we check the red one. So this one is a bit different, see? Uh, they'll stop. So even though I got it from the same vendors, they look identical. So these two are different. So this is a CNC. They put a, they put a, some sort of locking ring. So this is a traditional spinner. But this one just look like kind of like molded, kind of like machine mark. So you can see that. So the spin time will be different. Same as the cap, look like kind of molded cap so you have some sort of machine mark so you can see that the, the quality is, is a little bit different but when you put it on you, you cannot tell the differences they're pretty they all are pretty quiet and they all, the price will come down a lot it's less than ten dollars we will put the link underneath it so this one is good so all this is like $10. So let me know which one is your favorite. And then check out the link for the Sankang, Taizes, and Triniums, and uh, Angu. We will review in the black one soon. And, let me see. and that's it for today. Thank you for watching. And I will see you next time. Bye.